Hi, it's Brianna from Snake and Badger Crafts. Today, it's time to set up the glow forge. So we've got the glow forge on our workstation. We have a computer right over here ready for the Glowforge to connect. Now let's just get setting up. It's just getting the liquid running through it and telling me it's ready to try and connect to the internet. So I've got to connect to the Glowforge Wi-Fi since it sends out a temporary Wi-Fi for setup that should allow me to connect to the software program on the Glowforge website and we should be able to start a new print soon. Okay, the computer is connected. Let's see what else it's telling us to do. Well, the computer is finishing the Glowforge setup so we can start printing. Uh, let's talk about the general setup to the machine. It was actually fairly easy. Um, the hardest part was just getting the clamps and the vent clamp the vent and the clamp all put together and put onto the Glowforge itself. That was the hardest part. Then um, the next hardest part is just making sure your fingers don't touch the laser or any other extra components of the laser head. Um, I just had to make sure I touched only the black section, um, solid black sections. So no touching anything else that might potentially be um, able to make the machine run. Let's see what this is doing now. It took a minute for the computer to figure it all out. Um, once the Glowforge has been connected to the Wi-Fi of the computer, it then needs to connect to the house's Wi-Fi. So we then had to go through the Glowforge website to connect to our Wi-Fi. So now this is set up to the software. We're ready to print as soon as we got a pattern. Start to finish setup took about 10 minutes. Three of that was getting the hose connected and another three of those were just for the computer setup. Now that it's all set up, we're ready for our first print. If you are considering a Glowforge, or um, are going to buy one, please feel free to use our referral code. It saves you money and they actually gift us some money as well. If you want to see the first print on this new Glowforge, check out the video. If you enjoy content like this, please like. If you'd like to continue our journey, uh, please consider subscribing. Thank you. Bye.